What's up everybody, Elo I'm here, and I am very proud to bring you this game. I've wanted to record this game for the channel for a long time. I don't know why it took until uh, the coronavirus is going on to uh, get me to record it. But, welcome to Plague Inc. This is the phone version, the original version. And, fun fact about this game, this is the first phone game that I ever spent money on to buy it when it had a free version like i played the free version fell in love with it and bought it i have had this game for about seven years uh, the phone the phone i currently have is a newer one so i haven't unlocked a lot of stuff uh this is actually the second attempt at recording i realized that uh, one feature of the recording is not part of the problem series is going to be just uh, extra sprinkles here and there for you. Here's a very important one. We need drug resistance one. To make it work, it is we are immune to
something to help you, right? But as soon as you have some heat, the wall moves. I'm aware of it, and really right now, where I live at, most things are shut down, business-wise, like Walmart is even closing, and when does the Super Walmart ever close? I mean, going there, you, I mean, they, they, they pretty much sold out of everything, which is really telling on them, but they also need to get up to say next week. Rough year for them. I bought freaking poison ivy right now. But I'm having a drink. Everybody's out there. Oh, I'm worried about the coronavirus. No, I just want to quit itching. I just want to get this poison ivy gone. Oh, that's sad. over the 60 DNA we need. Now, the reason we need that is when we start getting symptoms, we need to start killing everyone as quickly as possible on here. And, well, to get up to having a symptom that can kill somebody, I need about 60 points. No, nope, you're not giving me anything. You're not going to be here. Now, with bacteria, when I re when I devolve and lose a symptom, it gives me points, DNA points. Viruses don't. Now, I do have a thing that will keep the viruses from costing, the cost going up, which will happen. Like, you'll devolve a virus and it'll cost you like one DNA, then next time two, four, eight. But with that gene modification I have for it, we ain't got to worry about it. If you look down at the bottom of the screen where it says world, you see that red and blue line? Blue is healthy, red is infected. i show you more of it. Look over there's dead, 273 dead from some kind of accident. Let's see what can we find what that was. Nintendo to pixelate toad in the future. Wow. Uh, Kim and Don live stream Fortnite from Singapore. Insurance firm aims to reclaim Millennium Falcon payout. Oh, wow. Oh, oh tsunami happened, hit Indonesia. Okay. But if we come over here and click World, there's a pie chart of infected... Healthy and dead. Tells us ARC has not been noticed. No work for to cure on us. And then there's all these little things. Really, this is the only one I use. So I know how many healthy countries and no one is infected. Infected countries, obviously, infected. Dead countries are countries where we've killed everybody. And we haven't got there yet. Oh, look at this. Greenland up here. Beautiful. So white and pristine on the map. Now, I do think it's funny the fact that they have a planet of the apes one on here. It actually is, uh, was added 
when the dawn of the planet of the apes came out which is funny because if you've seen the movie at the end it has a thing that looks like this showing the spread of the disease we're up to only almost five billion people infected nope nope can't let people get a rash from us now this method does not work for some of the later ones in the series in the, the later ones like the bioweapon and stuff they're a little harder you'll want to if you play the game you'll want to start out doing them like this a little bit but we're going to increase our infectivity maybe see on casual you really don't need anything but tier one of those We'll leave it like that. That just ups our air and water transmittability. Now that last one that hit in between ups them again, but simultaneously, but it costs a lot more. UK votes for... Voters in the UK vote to leave the EU. I remember hearing something about that, like years ago, I think. I actually remember when they added it to this game. I'm actually surprised there's nothing in the game about the coronavirus yet. Now, if y'all end up liking this series, once it's done, if y'all want, I do have the PC version uh, Plague Inc. Evolved. And we can do it too. How are we doing on in? Look, there are no more countries that are healthy. We have at least one person in every country in the world infected. Ooh, tsunami hits Brazil. Let's see, we had 237 dead. How many now? Ooh, 410 dead. I mean, that could have been a lot more people dead in Brazil. And yes, I know I keep saying the D word. Those of y'all who have been around on the channel for a while know I can't monetize anyway, so. Insomnia. Devolve. Okay. Now, I do have the settings in the game set where anytime something like that pops up, it does pause the gameplay. Which is why all the ships and planes stop moving. You can actually... Uh, that's something you have to turn on. It does not come on by default. Oh, we're getting close. Look at that. Barely any blue on that line left. Come on. Now, if the world gets a chance, uh, once we start giving symptoms, they'll add a blue airplane. But if we can kill people quick enough, they won't get that. That blue airplane is doctors and scientists traveling around from place to place trying to find a cure for us. Now watch Greenland up there. As we get the whole world infected, or just actually as we get more of Greenland infected, we will, that whole thing will turn red. Which is kind of cool. Now, if you want, Greenland is also another oh, kind of okay place to start. Greenland and Madagascar. And I want to say the Caribbean islands over near the U.S. Dang, another tsunami? This time Norway. That was a lot more dead in it. Um, they are places that can only be infected by boat. So, you have to make sure you can transmit by ship for that, to get those. Well, I say that, but there is a random chance that somebody in a country like that will spontaneously just contract the disease. How are we doing? 99% infected. We have 378,700 more people to go.
Severe storm strikes Argentina. Ooh, we haven't even got a symptom yet, and over a thousand people are already dead. Quit mutating symptoms. Now, actually, the, the bacteria randomly mutating symptoms is a good thing because you do get extra points for it. Now, also, the modification gems, if you decide to download this game, and you get the free version, you don't get any of the gene modifications. You have to have the paid version for that and for the speed-up ability. Oh, come on. If you look, that red and blue line down there has a little bit of black at the beginning of it on the opposite end from the blue. That's the dead people. Let's up our cold resistance so we'll spread better up in... Because as you can see, we're not spreading very fast up in Greenland and Iceland. Now we'll spread faster. Yeah, as you see, Greenland is now getting more and more red splotches on it, which we can actually zoom that in. Look at that. We are spreading like a plague. Hundred and seventeen DNA points, that's good. Could use more though. You never have too many. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Looks like a lot of people are just spilling blood all over the place up in Greenland right now on here. <laughs> Now you will notice at the bottom of the map there is Antarctica down there and you never infect anybody there. Alright, that's what we've been waiting for. No more healthy people left in the world. Now, I like starting with coughing because we have to go through this like this. Now, total organ failure. Coma. I'm going to come down here to insomnia because this little chain right here in starting with insomnia decreases the chance of people going to the doctor. Paranoia. Seizures is good. We need a few more points and then we can get insanity, which will really lower the chances of them working on a cure. Oh, new minor disease is spreading. In a normal checkup, a doctor in Philippines found a new disease which has been named ARC. It appears to be mostly harmless, but must be investigated further. Other countries are also reporting this disease. Now watch. First death in Korea. And look at our death toll shooting up. Philippines shut down land borders. Now, if this starts going quick enough, Oh, Southeast Asia has started working on a cure. 3%. If we can start getting people to die quick enough, we'll start gaining more DNA. Global research focused on finding a cure. There we go. Saudi Arabia begins to break down. How many was it we needed for? Ooh. Keep nausea. Is that enough? Yes. Insanity. Next we'll aim for dysentery. 28 DNA points. And look at how quick people are dying. For that cure, oh yeah, cure is up to 21%. Wow. We gotta watch for that blue plane. We got that. Spain and anarchy. <laughs> We have 31% left on that cure, but we're killing people quick enough that that should not be a problem. Get a fever, skin lesions, and that will, uh, if we hit 39, we'll be able to get this one, which is actually a good one for uh, transmitting. 
because it allows the corpses of people to still come into the group. We are victorious. Infectivity, severity, and mortality test. I see <laughs> it jumped up right there on severity. All right, let's see the next one. Nah, I'm not going to post it. But if you do want to take it and post stuff like that, that way. Tag me in. Let me know how you did. It took us 1,535 days to get into the water. But that is all the time I have for recording today. I do want to thank everybody for watching. If you have enjoyed this video, go ahead and hit that like button down below. Subscribe if you are new to the channel uh, and want to know what or want to see more. Uh, hit the notification bell if you want to know when I put videos up. I do want to thank you all for watching. I'll see you next time.